do it but if they break my limits like i cannot handle it anymore and it's so too much so yeah they it is okay for me to give them backwards wow mm. <sighs> like you got um i think like when you said uh that you are like insulting your company is not uh acceptable i mean when i used to work in a company like as a call center agent like my manager and my team leader also like told me like if the owner insulted the company it's fine even like if he's uh, if they are gonna like sell their house we are gonna like buy their house even like if he keep saying bad things about our company it's okay i mean do not like get nervous and it's not your problem, I mean, let him or her, like, say whatever she wants, or whatever he wants. Mm. Mm, like, not the same situation. So do you mean, like, uh, if, the, if the clients or the customers say bad things about the company, you are yeah, not... Yeah, it's fine. Like, it's fine. It's not your job to... It, you don't have to feel offended because of that. That's what you said? Yeah. And we oh. can deal with him like uh, a second time. It's fine. Mm. I think like uh, in your case, no, in your company, uh, like regarding to your company rules, like if the owner insulted the, the company, like uh, it's going to be done. Like you're not going to deal with him again, right? Yeah, actually like this. Um, it is me that I cannot accept people who uh, who insult the company where i'm working you know <laughs> why? I yeah, yeah. That. this is the question why i just feel like that like uh, you know maybe the company where i'm working is not perfect company but this is the place where i make halal money alhamdulillah <laughs> um, you know uh, I, I, oh, okay. mm -hmm. Yeah, and I treat, like, this is the place where I make money in a halal way, alhamdulillah. I provide myself and my, and, and my family. And then you condemn the place where I work and know nothing about it. This is not acceptable to me personally. I feel like as if you, as if this person insulting the company, my own company, not someone else's company. I cannot accept that, you know? <laughs> I was about to ask you, like, uh, is your father, like, the owner of this company? No. Like, why do you care? I, I care because, alhamdulillah, I, I just feel like, I don't know, maybe it is the people of this company actually treated us so well. We are taught that we, we are more like mm -hmm. a family, you know, subhanallah. And maybe because of that, I love the company and, and the people as well. I love my, not, well, actually loving the company is not so healthy, but... I don't, I cannot accept it when someone insults the work at the place where I work because, especially if it's not true. If it's not true, they say things, they just like that. I have to clarify that. Excuse me, this is not true. Okay. Uh, and I cannot accept that. So most of the time, I don't, I don't, I don't feel angry when someone actually behave, misbehave towards me. I mm -hmm. I go chill with that, but when they start insulting the company, oh, I take it serious. Like, stop doing that. You know, you cannot do that. <laughs> we know what we do, and you, what you say it's something absolutely off. What he say absolutely off. What I can say that uh, you love your job, so that's why, like, you feel like you are a part of this company. Yeah. Like nobody got the, the right to insult your company. And actually not all people like think in this way. You yeah. are like faithful. Kinda. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you know, some, some people I know sometimes some people will think, okay, the point is that I go to work. I done mm -hmm. with my work. I get paid. That's it. Me, work is not only like that. It's not enough for me. Yeah, you, you like your group, like your co-workers, mm. your company. 
I got many friends like they have the same mentality as yours, but for me, like I'm a bit freer. I don't care, like I just care about money. To be honest, mm. and that's okay. Actually, I understand. We don't always have the same intention. Uh, you know the the feeling that you're gonna feel. It is it is not come just like that. If the company doesn't t treat you well, for example, doesn't treat you as a human, the company treats you as a comp as as an employee. There will not feeling I think inside of anyone who who actually like okay this is the company where I work but also I'm a part of this company. You know I, I there is hello there is um I think I saw a talk like where the the difference about mm -hmm. the mentality between uh, among the employees like a company with the leaders who treat the employees, who treat the other members of the company, just like their family, behave absolutely different with the company who treat the employee just like an employee. They don't want to care about how is the situation of your family or how do you live your life. They just want to know, have you done with your work? Have you done with your test? That's it or not. So that's why the, the we don't blame the employee who get on, who go to work, and then just work for money and go home. We don't blame them. They say, you know, the leaders say, blame the leaders and blame the company not treating the employee as human, not just an, as human. You know, treat them as human before you treat them as an employee. Mm -hmm. And subhanAllah, that's so true. Yeah, it is. And actually, there are like some uh, other things related to this topic. I mean, maybe like your company is good and you guys are like uh, good people. But actually, like when um when I was working at this company, like property business solution, like my manager told me that uh, it's okay. Um, I mean, I told him that in this way, like we are tricking people, like we are scamming, we are scammers, and he said yes, we are. I mean. He kept telling me that you just like, you just have to talk to the owner like, and in the other stuff, like, it's not your business. And I kept telling him, like, why? But, like, some people, they are so naive about the prices of their houses. So they just, like, ask for, for example, like, there was an Indian guy. Um, he was living in California and his house, the market value of, of his house, like was about 450. Mm -hmm. And I think because like he's coming new, coming on uh, like he's new in this country, he asked for 85,000 mm -hmm. dollars. And we like, we bought the house from him by this number. Can you imagine that? It's a it's a big difference. Yeah, and we like. <clears throat> I mean, it's not halal, and yeah, it is not we, halal. We we took him for a fall. Oh, it is it is really not a good work to work, Osama. You still work? Yeah, I him? left it. <laughs> no, no, no. Alhamdulillah, that you left it. Yeah, alhamdulillah, like, I just told my team leader, like, <clears throat> I was not planning to leave this job, like, until I get angry, and I started, mm -hmm. like, act asking myself, why do you keep, like, working at this major, you don't like this work, and you trick people, and it's not the environment mm -hmm. that I wanted to be working in, so yeah. I just suddenly... <clears throat> I was angry and my team leader, like, she was blaming me <clears throat> because I did a mistake, like, I insulted one of the owners. Mm -hmm. So she said, so, I think it's to work in this case, Osama, you should, like, um, you should be cautious with your words and not to insult anyone and just be calm. And I said, so, you know, like, I'm not going to be working at this major again and... Yeah, tell your manager that I'm going to leave. And I just left. Mm. Yeah, that's it. <clears throat> so, 
Yes, yes, yes. But Alhamdulillah, you know, you leave that work. When I think I will do the same, you know, if I find something, go again, you know, my condition actually when I work, the work needs to go and know against the, the religion. That's my condition. I, I will leave the work no, ma no matter how good they treat me, no matter how good the, the money that I make there. If it go against the religion, I will leave it. Like, no, 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 how to say it. To me, like, mm -hmm. no compromise when it comes to, if they break the, 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 the law of religion, then bye-bye. Yeah, exactly, and it doesn't only like go against your <clears throat> your religion. Like, it was against your val uh, your um yeah. thoughts and values. Like, you know what I mean? Yes. Like, mm -hmm. <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry for that. Like, I got a cough. Oh, oh a cough. Okay. Here it's really cold. I don't know what is going on here. Like. It's gonna mm. be so cold in the next um, month. Mm. I think because um, winter is coming. Yeah, winter is coming from Game of Thrones. Like winter's <laughs> coming. Hello.